I mean, think about it when you fly on an airplane, right? Uh, or they advertise a trip. You're going to get bundles, and you can go um, get your airplane, you can get your car, and your hotel all together, and they're going to save you money. And at PatientCo, we put all these things under one platform, and when you bundle it all together, not only does it work better for more payments and in happier patients, but you're going to in lower your cost. And that's what hospitals need today with razor thin margins. Um, the last part about the payments that I'll throw out there that's kind of the secret sauce and the magic around it all is the data as we start to understand what's causing this patient behavior to shift. And that involves, when you study a payment coming through, you know, you start to know um, when a patient paid. Do they pay at day 30 or day 90? You start to know where a patient paid, right? Do they pay at the cardiology group or at the hospital? You start to know um, how a patient paid which is American Express, or are they on a um, check, or with cash, or online on a payment plan, right? And you know, when you start to put these how, when, where all together, you're gonna understand for the first time why a patient is paying. That's kind of the magic that, that you, you don't know, right? I mean, if you're listening to this right now, what causes you to pay? What causes you to pay is something that's probably completely different that what causes someone else to pay, your mom or your dad or your best friend. Same thing as if we go into a hospital and they want to treat us clinically, right? Based on our DNA, based on our lots of different blood type, lots of different factors, they're going to treat us all clinically very different. And listen to this, this is the most important part. If we can treat people financially very different and understand what gets them well, as we do in a clinical visit, then we can totally change the way revenue cycle works today around the fastest growing piece of revenue cycle and the hardest to understand, the hardest to manage, which is this patient responsibility portion. And you can only do that if you approach these problems first and foremost as a payments company. Study the payments and everything else is a byproduct of what is causing that payment to go through the channel. You can't do that unless you actually are moving the money, which we do, and you're an actual real payments company which no one in healthcare really is.